hello guys welcome back to my channel so happy new year to you guys um so today i have a prophetic teaching and it's based on the dream that i had of course this dream was a revelation about what god was trying to uh, show me about somebody's life so i'm not going to share everything in this uh, dream uh it's a personal dream but god allows me to teach on the dream so um, basically in the dream that I had, um, there was a couple and they had plates. So these plates were broken and they were kind of like off-white a little bit. And they, the plates were also like, you know, um, the couple, couple's plates were like uh, in the ground. And, you know, as God was revealing this to me, you know, I was like thinking about it and I was like, okay, I understand what it means. So in this situation, God is saying that don't serve each other on broken plates. So many of us are really, you know, excited about marriage, but yet we have not been healed and God wants to deal with our heart issues and he wants to um, uh, heal those broken places that we haven't unpacked. And basically these plates that God was showing me, they were in a box. So these plates, when I looked at them, <coughs> sorry, when I looked at them, they were broken and shattered to pieces. And we know that, you know, something that is broken, you know, it's hard to repair. And the only person that can repair those things is God. Because God is a potter and he can do whatever he wants with the clay. If we submit to God and if we allow him to prune us and, you know, uh, mold us into the people that he wants us to be, he will do that. He will do that for us. So God is saying that don't serve each other on broken plates. Uh, some of you guys have issues like, you know, daddy issues, um, you know, control issues and like, um, you know, things from the past that you haven't dealt with, past relationships and, you know, trauma, uh, rejection, all those things that God wants to um, heal. Because if we serve each other, we are going to hurt each other. We see that the plates in this um dream are like shattered okay and when you give somebody you can serve somebody on a broken plate if you try to give somebody on a broken plate they're going to hurt themselves when you try to eat on that plate so god is saying at this time that get healed first get your inner healing get your deliverance before you know you get married ask god what is in you that is hidden that he can uh you know heal and bring to the surface before you say i do because if you are serving on a broken plate you are basically you know destroying whatever you know god wants to do in your life because you can't serve somebody if your plate is not full because you're giving on emptiness on brokenness and god wants to restore those brokenness you cannot fix the plates by yourself because you're going to hurt yourself and if you have ever picked up glass before you know it's hard to pick up um, broken glass you have to get a broom and basically you know sweep it up and throw it away but we know that in Jeremiah, you know, God speaks of him, um, you know, being the potter. And, you know, we know that from a prophetic standpoint, Jeremiah had, if you look at the book of Jeremiah, I think it's chapter, I forgot, I'll put it on the screen. You know, Jeremiah talks about, you know, uh, you know, the potter, you know, remaking the, 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 the plate, the bowl and stuff like that. So we understand that God is the only one who can mold us and renew us and restore us because he can fix something that is impossible and make it possible and if you try to fix it yourself you might get hurt more so allow god to show you your uh, brokenness and the bible says god is closer to the brokenhearted and god wants to fill those spaces and be the only one so that you know your marriage is fruitful and allow him to be you know the vine the source that you get your strength from because you know god is uh, our vine and we are the branches of course he prunes his branches and we see that from um, John chapter 15 1 through 1 through 8 it says I am the true vine and my father is the gardener he cuts off every branch in me that bears no fruit while every branch that does bear fruit he prunes so that it will be even more fruitful you are already clean because of the word I have spoken to you remain in me as I also remain in you no branch can bear fruit by itself. It must remain in the vine. Neither can you bear fruit unless you remain in me. I am the vine, you are the branches. If you remain in me and I in you, you will bear much fruit. Apart from me, you can do nothing. If you do not remain in me, you are like branches that are thrown away and withers. Such branches are picked up, thrown into the fire and burned. If you remain in me and 
my words with me and you ask whatever you wish it will be done for you this is to my father's glory that you bear fruit show yourself to be my disciples remember uh we cannot serve each other on broken plates you need to get in a healing and allow the holy spirit to show you what is hidden in you whether you have daddy issues trauma uh you know control issues uh rejection issues uh jezebel mindset all those things um those are not the fruits of the Holy Spirit. So in order for us to bear fruits of the Holy Spirit, we have to be connected to the source. So we are connected to Jesus. And, you know, God cuts off any branches that do not produce fruit. So God wants to clean us so we can produce good fruits. So we can show ourselves to be approved. That's why the Bible says, study yourself approved so you can know God, okay, for yourself. And you can walk in victory all the time because the Holy Spirit reveal all things that are hidden about your life if you call unto him Jeremiah 33 verse 3 call unto me and I'll answer and I'll show you all hidden things that you have not known about your life so ask the Holy Spirit to bring healing to you ask him to show you some hidden things about your life that you don't understand and allow him to bring healing to those hidden places that haven't been touched because you know as i was looking at those plates some of the plates were underground so that means something is buried under and you know god you know wants to unpack it because the person was trying to give me into a box the plates were given into a box and i was looking at them they were broken and we cannot serve each other on brokenness we have to be healed and the holy spirit is the only one who can heal us as long as we're connected to the source and he wants us to produce good fruit you know and you know to show ourselves as his disciples you know as his bride okay so um this is the word that the holy spirit wanted me to share with you guys i hope you guys are blessed and thank you for subscribing for watching this channel and please i'm gonna leave um i'm gonna leave the comment form open so you guys can um you know hashtag question ask me any questions that you guys have about concerning marriage and whether seasons of marriage or anything like that and i will uh, I promise this time I will make videos answering those questions. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. God bless. See ya.